NVIDIA is jointly developing train vehicles with OEMs. NVIDIA today has over 8 million cars on the road with our technology inside. Um, these are companies throughout Europe, um, in Asia, and also in North America. What we do is really work with them very different than the traditional supply chain. NVIDIA is not a chip supplier. We don't sell a part to a tier one. The tier one pays us, we walk away, they build a box and sell it to the OEM. But rather NVIDIA partners with our automaker companies and jointly develop systems. These are very complex systems, combination of hardware, a lot of software, and then an application layer on top that's usually created by the automaker themselves. So the look and feel of the car is owned by the brand. Core technologies underneath are developed by NVIDIA. So we work with Audi, for example, and they use our visual computing module inside their MMI system, Audi Connect. That same module is part of the Volkswagen, also Seat, Skoda, so the other brands in the Volkswagen group. So the core hardware is leveraged, but the application layer software gives different interfaces and different look and feel and capabilities depending on the brand. Outside of, of some of the programs we're working on here to, to bring autonomous vehicles to, to market either in the US or in Europe or Asia, um, I think very likely some of the first autonomous vehicles that, that we're in um, won't even drive on this planet. We are working with Audi and a group called Part-Time Scientists. Uh, we're sponsoring them as part of the Lunar X Prize, and the goal is to put a, uh, an autonomous rover on the moon, and so that's probably going to happen in the next couple of years.